Hey, hello everybody. In this video, I'm gonna tell you why you shouldn't auto start Steam when you start up your computer or have it run in the background unless you're playing games. As you can see here, I don't have Steam running and the internet is working perfectly. Go to playlist, here we go. On the speed test, I have 723 megabits per second download, 23.4 megabits per second upload. And as soon as I start up Steam, I can't use the internet anymore. Let's do the test again. Essentially, Steam takes up all the bandwidth, at least the download bandwidth. So we went from 700 and something download to only 68. And you can see these spikes right here. So this is the bandwidth that Steam is taking up during the startup of the program. You've got to wait a few minutes for it to do its thing until you can use the internet normally again. I'm going to exit the program here. Let's see if the speed improves. Well, what do you know? Look at the difference. Isn't that crazy? All right, I'm going to show you what happens when I run Steam when my computer starts. So check this. Click OK, and then we're going to restart the computer. All right, Steam just started up. Let's use the internet. During the Steam startup, your internet is going to slow down to a crawl. Look at this. It takes so long for it to do anything. This is what happens when you auto start Steam with your computer. I went from 700 and something to 8.67 download speed. There you have it. Do not have Steam running unless you're playing games. Just exit the program and then you're going to have a lot faster speed. <laughs> Die of Modu, Nayuak, Yuk, Dine, Tumat, 